a year and a half ago, a new nonprofit was started in San Diego to bring together typically affluent neighborhoods with underserved ones. Today, the organization continues to grow and has branched out in its quest to create understanding and equity. As part of our series, Stories for Change, we're checking in with the Sister Cities Project. For over a year now, the Sister Cities Project has been bringing people together, people who might not otherwise meet. Right now, we have two prototypes, um, City Heights and Encinitas. And then there's the Solana Beach, Del Mar, Carmel Valley grouping with Southeastern San Diego. Sean McLondon is the nonprofit's founder and says the goal is to tackle racial tensions and bias by simply creating an opportunity where people can get to know one another and hopefully realize they're more the same than they are different. What gives me really the most satisfaction is hearing some of the stories um, that have come out of the things that we have done, the, the small impacts, the relationships that have been built between people from these two communities. But Sister Cities has grown from not only offering so-called cultural tours to other services. We then expanded into um, our business growth area of impact. Um, and we decided to focus primarily on black women entrepreneurs. And that's really about just growing small businesses. They've also started a workforce development component to help connect people with training and internships. McLendon says eventually he'd like to see his idea spread across the country. That if you scale that across the whole United States, it, it, you, I think that's where you, you start to see a shift in maybe how people think and that maybe you start to put a dent in racial inequality and, and economic inequality. And the Sister Cities Project will hold its first formal fundraiser tomorrow at the Belly Up Tavern. April and the Funk Junkies will play a concert with part of the proceeds going to the nonprofit. You can get more info at sistercitiesproject.org.